Hey, how's it going? Today we're gonna go inside my minivan. It's my mom mobile. You all have one, whether yours is a minivan or something cooler like an SUV. We're gonna get in, take an honest look around, which is actually kind of embarrassing and a little bit disgusting, but I'm sure you relate. And then I'm gonna clean it all out, show you some tips and tricks for how to clean yours, and also to go one step deeper and actually detail the whole thing. So let me tell you, it took a lot of self-restraint for me to not pre-clean my car before letting you all take a peek. This is raw and it's really disgusting. And embarrassingly enough, it's only one week worth of grossness. Let's take a look. I don't even really know where to start, except for that I know where all the shoes are that are not in my house because they're here in my car. And that's why my kids can't ever find them. Caffeine a couple times a day helps us all get through it, right? I know, I know you relate. I know you all know what this is. This is Command Central, where you're here and the only place you have to put anything is here. So for your basic weekly clean of your mom mobile, you're gonna want three things. Two laundry baskets and a garbage bag. I find that most everything in my car will fit into one of three categories. Either it's garbage or it's actual laundry or it's something else that doesn't belong in the car that needs to go somewhere else in the house or the garage or the backyard. So starting with these three things, I'm gonna be able to clean everything out of the car. Let's just get started and take every single thing out so that we can get down to the nitty gritty. And I just want to note that I did dump clean unfolded laundry out of these bins so that I could use them to clean out the car. I'm gonna get back to that and fold it all probably later. I was actually looking for this. And then this is disgusting. I don't even know what this stuff is. These are cool though. I have one of these almost everywhere. It's like a multi-tool, eight in one. That's a super cool thing. That's just Something got real gross in here. temporary solution for this situation. Just like go in there with this. This right here is the reason that we're cleaning out the mom mobile. That. I think everything's out. Almost. So after you've pulled everything out of your car and revealed a lot of things that you might not like about yourself and your family, then you're gonna wanna just get back in there with the vacuum. So when I do this weekly, I just drive my car through the local car wash and they have free vacuums that I can use after. Um, at home, you can use a shop vac, you can use an attachment for your regular home vacuum cleaner, you can use like one of those little tiny guys, whatever works to just get up the dust and stuff so that it starts to get a little more clean in there. Here we go. Okay, so once you vacuumed on a basic clean, the next thing you wanna do is just get in and wipe down all the surfaces, wipe off the seats, wipe off the, the console and everything. I keep these in the um, glove compartment so that I usually have them when I'm ready to go. Also, if you're a mom, you know you've got some baby wipes on hand and they work perfectly for this kind of stuff. So just get in, wipe everything down. And, um, and then if you were doing just your regular clean, you can start putting stuff back in and you're gonna be good to go. Today, I'm gonna use the AutoWrite steam machine to show you how to actually get the stains out of the carpet, clean off the leather, and all of the disgusting things that you can't get to with baby wipes in a vacuum, and really make this car shine like new, even though it's not new. So if you were going to get your car detailed professionally, it would cost two or three hundred dollars, and they might not do as good of a job as you can do yourself, because you can do this yourself. I do this myself um, using this tiny little thing. This is the AutoWrite steam machine. I'm obsessed with it because it's tiny and perfect and cute and it's gonna help you detail clean all of those things that feel like you really can't clean. 
like your leather or the stains in the carpet or really anything in your car or in your house and I'm going to show you how. But if you want the full DIY of how to get started and how to hook it all up and everything, click on the link in the description that will send you to the Home Right YouTube channel where I'm doing a full getting started with the Auto Right steam machine and you can kind of see all the ins and outs and then head back over here and I'll show you on the car how I'm actually going to use it really well and um, have this beautiful finished product. I mentioned the cost of a detail is, you know, two or three hundred dollars. This little guy's under a hundred dollars and you can get it on Amazon. I think it's a pretty good uh, option for taking your car cleaning a step further. We've got a lot of things going on. There's like dirt and something that looks like chocolate and something that looks like lemon cream. All food things, of course. The whole thing just needs to be taken care of. So I'm excited to just get in there and take care of it because it's really bad. It just melts. It's the best. I mean, seriously, I'm in love. Goodbye, lemon. Goodbye, chocolate. Yeah, go ahead, take a look. Check that out. Five seconds later. So we did it. We finished cleaning the Mommobile and it feels so much better than it did before. Um, if you keep it up, it's going to be a lot easier. Do your quick weekly cleaning using your bins and your garbage bag and then get in there with a steam cleaner every once in a while and get all that grime and the taffy and the dirt and the milkshakes out of everything. Um, so if you liked this video, remember to go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss anything uh, as I'm sharing how to live a creative, adventurous lifestyle as a mom. And also I want you to leave in the comments what the most disgusting thing that you've ever found in your mom mobile is. I'm pretty sure that there's some good ones out there and I wanna hear all about it. Thanks so much for being here. See you later.